Peace and love, everybody. It is your brother Judah Sun with Put It Out There TV, also known as P I O T TV. Hashtag Put It Out There. Um, as you can see, this video is titled something along the lines dealing with Fox News exposing a secret relationship between YouTube and the Southern Law Poverty Center. A relationship, of course, that shouldn't be a uh, secret whatsoever. This is something that I should have recognized uh, a long time ago, but it makes sense. Um, but before we even get into this whole thing of Fox exposing this relationship between the Southern Law Poverty Center and YouTube, I want to go ahead and give some commentary on my particular experience with the Southern Law Poverty Center. Um, so, of course, you guys already know the, uh, or well, you should be familiar with, the Judah Sun P-I-O-T TV YouTube channel has been terminated, along with the Marketing More YouTube channel and the, and the, uh, the Moore's Marketplace and More YouTube channels have all been obliterated off of YouTube. Um, I don't like it, but I'm not in a position to where I can't continue to do me because this is something that I saw coming months ago, which is why we now have Put It Out There TV, a website that can be used independently of YouTube whatsoever. But um, I don't know if any of you guys remember, but on some of my videos on some months back, and, and, and please, I do apologize. Right now, I'm standing by a river that's by my house, um, and that's what you hear in the background, so just bear with me. But uh, months ago, if you guys remember on the Judah Sun P.I.O.T. TV YouTube channel, I had mentioned something about, um, you know, something about the Southern Law Poverty Center dr uh, driving traffic to my YouTube channel. And uh, basically what I was saying was, you know, when you're a YouTube partner or a YouTube content creator, there's an app that you can download, which is the YouTube Studio app. And on that app, you can look at the age, uh, the age range of the, uh, of the um, you know, of your audience. You can see which videos are getting the most views. You can see which videos are making the most money. And you can also see where your traffic is coming from. You can see if your traffic is coming from Instagram. You can see if it's coming from Twitter. You can see if it's coming from Facebook. You can see if it's coming from the Southern Poverty Law Center website, right? So, um, I started noticing that I was getting uh, traffic from the Southern Law Poverty Center website, right? And after that, I had a more, you know, send me a screenshot of an image of an article that he had come across on the Southern Poverty Law Center website to where they had allegedly they were supposed to have quoted something that I said. They were supposed to have quoted something that I was alleged to have said. And you know how they quote something and they hyphenated and put your name next to it. But what they did was they hyphenated that quote, put Judas son next to it. And they hyperlinked that Judas son term so that it went back to my YouTube channel. So anytime anyone came across that article on the Southern Poverty Law Center, it would come to the YouTube channel. Now me, myself, I have a, a rather small um, I have a rather small YouTube channel, so, or I had a rather small YouTube channel. So for me to be on the radar of the Southern Poverty Law Center simply means that I've done what I was supposed to do with my, with, uh, with my search engine optimization to make sure that I was the first one somebody found with this Moore stuff when it came to the Moore National Identification Cards or whatever the case may be. Um, so with that, I put two and two together. I said, okay, I've been getting this traffic coming into my YouTube channel from um, the Southern Poverty Law Center website. And on top of that, I got another brother, a brother who's giving me this image screenshot showing me that the Southern Poverty Law Center has wrote, written an article with me uh, about me or mentioned me in an article. And I've seen this article myself. I clicked on the link and it takes you back to my YouTube channel or my former, my ex, my used to use uh, YouTube channel. And, you know, so with that being said, I always had some things in the back of my mind that a lot of the trolls that I was dealing with on my YouTube channel, and I apologize if I'm speaking too loud. Um, a lot of the trolls that I was, that I was dealing with on my YouTube channel, I felt like a lot of that troll traffic was coming from Southern Law Poverty Center's website. 
that's what I did. It's always in the, been in the back of my mind. It was a gut feeling that I had. And I'm telling you, there's these gut feelings. They, they never, they never stare me wrong whatsoever at all. <clears throat> so I'm having this thing. Okay. These trolls I'm dealing with a lot. A majority of them are coming from the Southern Poverty Law Center. That's where they're coming from. You know, so I'm dealing with all these different trolls and I notice these trolls <clears throat> are going to this specific video because the, I'm sorry, the Southern Poverty Law Center, the hyperlink that they did for Judah Sun on their article went to a specific video. So I'm noticing these trolls that I'm getting are always a majority of the time on this specific video that I was, uh, that, that the Southern Poverty Law Center had linked in their article, right? This is where the troll comments were coming from. So this video, not only is it getting trolled a lot, but it's getting a lot of views and this video is also monetized, which means I was getting a lot of, um, um, I was making some money off of the, not, you know, I wasn't getting rich, but I was making some money off of that particular video. So fast forward to the channels being deleted and, and, and thinking and remembering comments where people, trolls would come into the comment section and say, your time is, your days are up. You only got this. You only gonna be doing this for so long. You just wait and see. One, you know, so to me, see, I'm tuned in. To me, that's saying, you're telling me that my YouTube channel is most likely gonna be taken down. So that's when I went into action because I was getting flagged a lot. <coughs> so that's when I went into action. And that's when I started, you know, building to put it out there, TV.com website. So fast forward, the channel gets, all these channels get deleted, right? And now, since I've had it in the back of my mind this whole time that the Southern Poverty Law Center is part of the reason that I've been getting these trolls coming to the Judah Sun PIOT TV YouTube channel and trolling and flagging videos, um, that's been in the back of my mind the whole time. I said, you know what? Now it's now I have the time. I have the power of the media. I have put it out there tv.com. I have unlimited photo, unlimited video, unlimited audio hosting for this website. Now it's time for me to go into the Southern Poverty Law Center and study them and see what they're about. So as I'm looking and I'm going this, you know, pulling up information, I'm seeing that while the Southern Poverty Law Center are, are you know, they're throwing stones about how all these different people are hate groups and such and such is a hate group and this is a hate group and this is an extremist. I see that there are other organizations out there that look at uh, that look upon the Southern Poverty Law Center as extremists, as a hate group. <coughs> um, so I found it quite I found it quite befitting. I found it quite ironic and I wasn't surprised to come across this particular information so one of the uh one of their oppositions that i happened to come across was uh fox news and i happened to come across a fox news video on the fox news youtube channel and just in case that particular video was going to be flagged or taken down i have downloaded that particular video and you can see it <coughs> excuse me and you can see it on the put it out there tv.com website um, of where I have an article written on this or, or or you can actually see it and you guys can view the video on the put it out there tv.com website the link is in the description link is also in the comments if you are viewing this on YouTube because you may not be viewing this on YouTube um, and basically what happens is after an investigative report Fox News has been able to come across some information that ties YouTube and Southern Law Poverty Center together. They've been in bed together. So there may, there may, there may be a possibility that YouTube is cutting Southern Poverty Law Center a check. Let me tell you why. Because it has been exposed that YouTube has been utilizing Southern Poverty Law Center. They've been utilizing Southern Poverty Law Center to police the content that is being put out, excuse me, on YouTube. Again, Fox News has exposed the YouTube for utilizing Southern Poverty Law Center for policing content that is being put out on YouTube. Now, if this content is anti 
anything politically or socially um, or if it's anti some of the things that the Southern Poverty Law Center stands for, right, then they see them as an enemy. Now, don't get that confused because I know the Southern Poverty Law Center says they're anti-hate, they're anti-this, they're anti-that, but their actions seem to say otherwise, right? So, um, I want you guys to go ahead and see this video. I don't want to go ahead and say too much. I just wanted to give you some commentary on my specific situation that I'm dealing with to kind of give you a background story on why Fox, uh, or to give some validity to what Fox News is saying about YouTube and the Southern Law Poverty Center. So, um, if you're saying things that the Southern Law Poverty Center doesn't agree with, if you happen to be seen with somebody that the Southern, Southern Law Poverty Center doesn't agree with, then they are going to brand you as a hater, a person of hate, an extremist, all of these negative things, they're going to write articles about you, they're going to put you on a list on their website as being haters, right? As being anti-government, as being extremists, so they can make you look bad, right? Which honestly makes it easier to kill you. It's propaganda is what it is. So without further ado, if you're interested in that particular Fox video that I came across, you can view it on the PutItOutThereTV.com website. Link is in the description of this video, depending on where you're viewing this at. Uh, the link is also in the uh, comments, depending on where, you, where you're viewing this at. Now, this is what's so crazy. Fox News is a very large media outlet. So the simple fact that this particular video that I'm speaking of has less than, I believe, has less than 12,000 hits, less than 11,000 hits as I'm currently doing this particular video broadcast, whatever the case may be, it lets you know that they've been unboosted, blacklisted for that particular broadcast. They may even be blacklisted and demonetized on YouTube, period. So, but I want to expose this and show you that the Southern Law Poverty Center is out here playing dirty. And you can best believe that I, Judas Son, am now on Southern Law Poverty Center's ass. I got the time. I had the power of the media. We'll put it out there, TV. Y'all rock with me if you are viewing this on YouTube. Please make sure that you like, you share, and you subscribe. Um, subscribe, comment, whatever the case may be. But check out that link and check out that video that Fox has now put out, or it's been out since February, exposing the Southern Law Poverty Center, Southern Poverty Law Center, whatever the case may be. And you'll see that uh, some of you will now see why your channels are being deleted, why, <clears throat> why your uh, videos are being deleted, why you're being flagged, why you're dealing why you are dealing with all these trolls. They're coming from the Southern Poverty Law Center. All right, again, this is Judas Sun. We'll put it out there, TV, also known as P-I-O-T TV. Make sure that you go below this video, click that link, or if you are already viewing this on the PutItOutThereTV.com website, then all you need to do is go below this video and view that article. Read that article, check out that video, leave a comment, subscribe to the website, to the YouTube channel, whatever the case, and let us know what you think. All right, I peace, peace and love. Appreciate y'all rocking with me. One.